This is Terry Knight with Garden Bite, and today I am going to make infused sugars. It's really super easy, but it just depends on what you want to do. So, I'm going to start out with um, the sugar I use. It's organic, and I use cane sugar, but you can use beet sugar or coconut sugar, anything like that will be just fine. The most important thing when you are making infused sugars is, of course, selecting the cute little jars in case you want to give these as gifts, which is kind of the whole idea that I'm doing it. But you need to make sure that the jars are clean and they're also dry, okay? And somebody's phone just dinged, but that's okay. So <laughs> I'm just kind of winging this. Anyway, so I've got these little baby ball jars. They're pretty adorable. Uh, they are about a half cup. So I have measured out a half cup of sugar. And I'm going to put that in this bowl, okay? And then what I'm gonna make first is a lemon infused sugar. And what I've done is grated some lemon, okay? got some lemon zest and the phone keeps going off <laughs> which is okay because my husband is coming to go answer the phone anyway so I am going to put the lemon zest and it's about a teaspoon that I have done I've grated so far for the half cup of sugar so I'm gonna put that in there And I am using a fork to stir this in because I think it works much, much better. Okay, so we just stir that up. And what is going to happen is because the lemon is a bit damp, it is going to clump the sugar a little bit so rather than put it in the jar immediately, I am going to let this dry out, okay? And then we'll unclump it and put it in the jar. So there you go, see? All right, there's that one. Now, the other one that I want to do is I am going to mix allspice, here we go, there we go, and cloves. And what I'll do is make a smaller, a little bit smaller ratio, and add some actual cloves into the jar. All right, so bear with me. I'm gonna 